This is example two from textbook. It says TP and TQ are two tangents that is drawn to a circle. You can see in the figure TP and TQ are two tangents drawn with center O being the center. From an external point T, T is an external point here. What we have to prove here that these angles are equal. That means they are asking to prove this angle. Say that is PT Q is equal to twice angle POQ. This is what we need to prove. So what we can do here, first of all, we can uh, name these angles. Let's say I'm naming this angle as say, angle one, all right? And then we have a construction to do. In this construction, we are going to join this line. That means we'll be joining O with the, O which is the center with a point of contact here. And uh, let's say may name this angle as angle two here, right? Now, first we will consider this triangle that is in triangle, which is POQ. We have uh, OP is equal to OQ. As you know that these are radii, right? OP and OQ will be equal here because they are radii. So we'll write out the reason here that is radii, right? You know that radius of same circle are equal. So therefore using isosceles property, I can write angle one is equal to angle two that is by isosceles property that means angles opposite to equal sides are equal now once we are done with this we can apply angle sum property in this triangle again so we will be saying that uh, in the same triangle so no need to mention the name of the triangle again we can simply write that is angle one plus angle two this is angle two plus angle p o q is equal to 180 degree and that is by angle sum property. So what we are doing here, we are considering this triangle. This is triangle POQ and we are going to apply angle sum property. We have applied angle sum property. So some of these three angles will be 180 degree. We can mark this equation say one and this as two. After that, we are going to consider the whole triangle. This time, uh, whole quadrilateral. That means this quadrilateral you can consider here is uh, this one, right? This whole quadrilateral. This is a quadrilateral, and we are going to apply the angle sum property in this quadrilateral. What we can say here that is, uh, say angle T plus angle TPQ plus angle POQ, and then plus angle. T Q O. As you know, sum of uh, all angles of a quadrilateral is 360. We can write 360. Later, you should know that uh, radius is perpendicular to the tangent at the point of contact. So therefore, this angle will be equal to 90 degree. And so will be this. That means we can replace this with 90 degree and again this with 90 degree. So that means if we write these two as 90 degree, what do we get? Angle T plus 90 plus angle POQ plus 90 is equal to 360 degree. Now, this is angle T plus angle POQ. As you can see, 90 plus 90 will be 180. So 360 divided by 360 minus 180 will be 180 degree. I'm going to mark this equation as equation two. Now from the, uh, these two equations, as you can see that in both the equation, the sum of the sum is 180, right? As you can see in equation two, the sum is 180 degree. So that means we can equate the LHS and RHS. I mean, both being 180 degree. So I, what I can write from equation two, which is T plus angle POQ must be same as this because this angle is also, the so sum of these angles are also 180 degree. That is angle one plus angle two plus angle POQ. As you know that opposite side, uh, same side get canceled. So this will get canceled here. So we got angle T is equal to angle one plus angle two. Now look into the first equation. What we have proved here, we have proved angle one being equal to angle two. So I can replace one with two or maybe two with one. So we are looking for this angle, which is angle one in our case, as we have taken this angle as angle one. So what I will be doing, I'll be writing angle one as one, but angle two as angle one. As you know, angle one and angle two are equal. 
So we'll be writing angle T is equal to twice angle one. And later on, I can replace this angle one with its, the name that is angle OPQ. OPQ. This is how this question can be proved.